amiguis, welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Emily. And as you can tell, we are not at the casita today. We are actually at my mom's. But yeah, we are here with my mom today because Mother's Day is coming up and we decided to work on a fun little video for you guys where we will be making some arroz con leche. So mom, you wanna come out? <laughs> Hi, everybody. <laughs> Welcome to my kitchen. I got to prepare arroz con leche. Oh, you're so cute. Okay, so there you have it. We're going to be making some arroz con leche for you guys. But before we get started with today's video, I want to thank our sponsor, which is Ana Luisa. So as you guys know, we love Ana Luisa jewelry. And right now they are running their Mother's Day sale, which is a buy one, get one 40% off. And my mom doesn't know yet. I actually got her a little gift, a little early Mother's Day gift. She loves her Ana Luisa ear. Earrings. You have them on right now, right? Yes. Yeah. She loves her Ana Luisa earrings, so I decided to get her a little something new. Oh, thank you. Oh my god. You like them? <laughs> so here's the new pair that I got my mom. Thank there you. you. <laughs> because I love this one. Thank <laughs> okay. You. So I'll put it. I'll put it away for you. Okay. But yeah, little early Mother's Day gift for for you. But. If you guys are looking for a Mother's Day gift or just any gift in general to a mother that you love and support, then definitely check out their website. I'll have the link down below. I really love Annalisa Jewelry because they craft high quality jewelry pieces at very affordable prices. For example, some pieces start out as low as $39. I also really like how unique and classy their jewelry is. It's simple enough for me to feel comfortable layering and mix matching. So these earrings that I'm wearing right here are their low medium earrings. And above those, I'm wearing the scarlet earrings. And as for rings, this is what I'm styling today. I always wear my rope slim. And recently, I got this new paisley ring, which I love. It's super cute and dainty. And they all pair super well with my more simple slim rings. And of course, I had to finish it off with some chain necklaces. So definitely you don't want to miss out on their buy one get one 40% off Mother's Day sale. You could find all the information down in the description. All right, now I think we should get started with making the arroz con leche. So my mom makes this for us all the time since we were little. She makes the best arroz con leche. <laughs> also, this is the first time that I'm trying to make it. So she's basically teaching me. Okay, so we're gonna get started. And first, let's know what, let's figure out what the ingredients are. So mom, what are the ingredients that we need for okay. the arroz con leche? Okay, so I need one cup of rice, one stick of cinnamon, and um, always I use just uh, maybe half um, orange skin. I, I use uh, condensed milk, two egg yolks, and I need uh, raisins. So the, the rice you need to soak in the, in the water at least for 15 minutes. It's already clean. So you're going to cook in four cups of water. Okay, so the water was already boiling. Yeah. It's four cups. So wait, how many cups of the of the rice is it again? One cup of rice and four, four cups, cups of, water. of water. Got it, got it. Okay. Yes. You put the orange inside. If you don't have orange, you can put lemon. Okay. Instead. Is it weird that I didn't put know? The cinnamon. Is it normal to put the orange? Yeah. If you want to put it like this, or it's up to you. Maybe you can. You want to grain it in the in the last minute in the top because when you cook the rice so the flavor you know come together and, and taste so good okay nice so yes you leave it there maybe 15 minutes okay so another 15 minutes depends the rice and depends uh, how you know come after you soak it in the water sometimes it's more easy so okay so do you recommend the jasmine rice over other rice as um, mejor what is it or I re well for cooking rice that's a matter because some people like like oh like pudding yeah like more you can um, talk if you want if you like know what whatever say. Well, for me, it doesn't matter because certain rices are more starchy. Yeah. So you want like a starchier, creamier yeah, rice? Cream. Do like a yeah. do like like jasmine or boy or like a short grain rice? Yeah. Short okay. grain so rice. So that's a matter. Okay. Uh, My brother is on recording right now, and he's a chef, so just. <laughs> <laughs> and everybody waiting for the rice. Okay, so we had put the rice in the boiling water, but my mom keeps it on high, and we're gonna keep it on high for 15 minutes or until obviously the rice is cooked. So now we wait. Okay, so the rice is ready, and Emily, she's going to start here. Oh, okay, take yeah. the stuff out? Yeah. Okay. Now. Just put it here? Yes. Now I 
I'm going to use just the egg yolks. Oh, uh -huh. Only the egg yolks. Okay. So this one is already clean. I wash it or always I like to always wash, wash and clean your jars. <laughs> okay. Can I pour it? Yeah. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Ooh. And sometimes I buy this one and sometimes I buy the different. I can literally just eat it with a spoon. This is a 13 ounce, okay? You doing the close-up picture? Let yeah. me know. Mom's like, I wanna do it. <laughs> ya casi es todo. Yeah. Quarter One cup, cup raisins. Yeah. And then I leave a little bit only for put it in the top. So just leave it for at least 10 minutes here. When you add the egg, uh -huh. you need to very, very be careful. Okay, why? Because you need to move really, really good and faster. You don't want scrambled eggs. You don't want scrambled eggs. eggs. Okay, okay, so. Okay. So when you put the egg, so you need to put low. You make sure you put at the same time and start move faster. And then you leave it for like 10 or 15 minutes. Depends so, if, it, the, the, if you like more fat, you leave like 15. If you like less, like more. Uh, okay, so is it like you want it more pudding ish? Yeah. Like if you want it more like a pudding, then you leave it longer. Also, make sure that you are mixing your arroz throughout the, the cooking process. <laughs> Say hi. Literally the only reason why Hector is waiting here is so he could get his arroz con leche. Quick tip from my brother who is a chef. Um, my mom doesn't add salt to her arroz con leche, but apparently you can if you want to, right? Right, so that's like a little chef trick. You could do a little pinch, a little dash of sea salt and it just brings out all the, all the flavor. Okay, so it has been 10 minutes, right? Yes. Seven minutes and the rice is ready. Now what? <laughs> now what? <laughs> now what? <laughs> No, you don't? No. Here, it's okay. You sure? It's okay. That's ready. Ground cinnamon. Did we add the extra raisins already? Mm, okay. A couple ones. I love raisins, so I'm going to be adding some more on top. <laughs> Does that look okay? Take forever to... <laughs> I know. Hold on, let me... There we go. That's cute, right? It looks like a... Muffin or chihuahua? Rice pudding or chihuahua? Good. Okay. Okay, so there's other condensed milk that's like just looks whiter or something, but the brand that we get, it has like a more like little yellow tint to it. But here's our arroz con leche. All right, so I'm gonna taste it now. All right, let's see how we did. It's hot, be careful. It's hot. It's hot. Mmm, but it's good. All right, Hector, take a taste. <laughs> Good? Gouda? Mm, really good. Nice. I was asking you, so when you, you've made a arroz con leche, right? I have. The only like different options that you could do is like instead of condensed milk, you could do whole milk, add some little bit of sugar, like cane sugar, you could add some vanilla extract to give it an extra flavor. You could do some like lemon or lime zest, that would definitely bring out those aromas in the rice. Uh, so for example, my mom uses um, yolks. That What that does, it gives it that richness, that custardy type of flavor. Uh, but you don't have to do that, uh, you can just do it clean, you know, just milk, sugar, type of rice pudding. But yeah, there, there's the arroz con leche. Are you going to want a good amount? How much do you want? Ah, we can just eat it out of here. Actually, no. Like for Christmas time, we do have it cold sometimes. And yeah, it's, it's a nice little treat. Well, you're gonna have to hit the gym after this. <laughs> <laughs> Only if you want. Only if you want. <laughs> Okay guys, so that's gonna be it for today's video. I really hope that you liked it, and if you did, don't forget to leave a like, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please don't forget to subscribe, and you could join the family. Also, don't forget to check out Ana Luisa for their buy one, get one, 40% off Mother's Day sale. Once again, the link is down in the description. Definitely check it out. We love our Annalisa jewelry and I'm sure that you guys would love it too. And if you're looking for a gift for your mother or a mother that you adore, then definitely check it out. 
And yeah, that's gonna be it. Thank you guys again for watching and see you next time. Thank you. Thank you for following us. <laughs> yes, follow us. Follow, follow if, us. If you subscribe to me and you follow me, you will get a lot more of my adorable mother. So if you like her, definitely don't forget to subscribe so you can see more of her. Bye. 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 Adios. Adios. Hasta luego. Hasta luego. <laughs> Como va esta rica relación No me gusta como ya ha cambiado dirección Y me gusta que me trates Así Esta mujer